when I was secondary school because my tuition is nearby. So I will pass by. When the overcrowded, then my father will say, Can you do me a favor? Help me sweep the floor to buy the clippers, the blades, and everything. Hey, I'm Kokilen. I am the current owner of Marina Hairdressing Salon. From 1st September of 1979, my grandfather created this shop and it's followed by inheritance by my father and now it's my time to revolve Marina. I think the Indian barber shop is perfectionist because once I come here, I feel like I feel my haircut is very, very done. My heart feels it perfect. Usually the regulars, they don't need to say anything. They will say, Anna, you know, as usual. And they are bringing their children and they are bringing their grandchildren also. Actually, once I take over, I've been through a lot of depression. Covid is a, is an accident disaster because the customers are very less. They are scared. Like last time they cut once a week, but now they are cutting it down for once a month or twice a month. So basically it affects us a lot. I never have that idea to close down my business. I have to sustain and I need to be perfect and I need to be a successful man in this industry. If I don't take over this opportunity, there will be some other people will grabbing this opportunity and they will become a successful man, which is a shameful for me and a shameful for 40 years old industry. Actually, the culture is dying because the children don't feel excited to take over the business. I will be sad if my children don't take over my business because it's like so many years back. But I just will motivate them. I will see how it goes. Currently, my vision so far will be to teach youngsters to cut hairs because we are short of manpower in this industry. In this case, we have to bring up some youngsters who are interested, bring it to the academy, teach them and everything. And we have to set up the business for them. So they no need to take out their own model. So this culture will be grow up again. If I don't do this, the culture and everything will be dying. This power shop means to me a lot. A lot of special moments are here. I see a lot of people gather a lot of knowledge from this barber shop. It's like my second home. <laughs>